Hi, I'm Matt Smutriassi with VTV and I'm here with Alex. Hi, uh, we're here at the CRC kickoff and basically we have a bunch of students uh, that are going to be participating in the kickoff and they're taking measurements of the field and uh, getting ready for the upcoming competition. I'm just here talking with Alex about how he thinks it's going to go. So Alex, what do you think of the competition this year? Uh, honestly, I'm really happy with it. Uh, we spent a lot of time working on it this year, put a lot of thought into it. Uh, compared to previous years, it's pretty simple, uh, but I'm looking forward to how people interpret it. And uh, the thing with simple competitions is that there's so much room that you, so much room for imagination and how you want to approach it. And I'm really looking forward to see what the students come up with. Patrick from Vanier, I'm the build captain. Alright, so Patrick, um, what do you think uh, the biggest challenge is going to be this year for uh, this year's competition? Uh, I think it'll definitely be getting the spools out of the containers and trying to avoid falling in the giant hole in the field. Um, what do you think your, uh, your, your best bet is going to be in terms of strategy? Um, our best bet for strategy is going to be not catching on fire for sure and definitely to get those spools out as fast as possible and get them over to the other side of the wall as fast as we can. Hi, I'm here with Nick. All right, Nick, so let me, let me ask you, um, are you excited for the competition first and foremost? Yes, I am. I, I'm really excited, actually. All right, so uh, what school do you represent? Um, I actually represent two schools. Um, I'm competing with Dawson, but I also mentor at my high school. Okay, interesting, interesting. So we all know that you're from Dawson and you think that you're going to do pretty good, but uh, who do you think some of your biggest competitors are going to be? Um, definitely going to be, uh, well, Mac always does really well. Um, I think uh, I think my high school, Centennial Regional, is going to do really well. They, uh, they have a lot of committed people there. And um, I don't know, I think, uh, well, Zvania usually does pretty well as well. So uh, I don't know, but I hope everybody does well. All right, so I'm here with Xavier. All right, Xavier, tell me, um, what do you think of the, this year's competition? Well, Loops 2017 shows that really the CRC evolved a lot. You can see from the new playing field that this year is going to be a much more level playing field in both sides of the ways, since uh, last year was a bit uh, chaotic to move around, since the plywood itself was really not equal. So with the new playing field, it's going to be really easy to make a nice robot that's going to be able to go all over the place. Not only that, well, the new programming competition, it's going to be a separate robot this year. So everyone's going to be able to participate without sacrificing time for their actual robot. Okay. And uh, who do you think your you know, biggest uh, competitors are going to be? Who do you think is going to perform the best and that you're really going to be vying for first position with? Well, last year, Mamorossi, my team, actually won. So uh, I think we're kind of the favorites for that. But Vanny is a really strong team. Last year McDonald was really close to winning also and uh, there's Bud Boulogne also that's really fierce competitors and maybe the new Vancouver team might have a chance. We have no idea how they're gonna be. Yeah it's, it's really cool. What do you think of uh, the CRC finally involving uh, a, a team from like the other side of the country basically? Well at the same time it's gonna be a nice opportunity for us to see what they think of the competition here and uh, it's not gonna be the CRQ anymore it's gonna be the CRC. Finally it's gonna be a more national competition itself and it's, I really think it's a it's a next step forward to make the competition even bigger than it is right now. 